Oh my god, Leafy, you're fucking gay! Oh, sorry, just reading a comment from my last video, okay? But everybody gets fucking hate, okay, on YouTube. I don't care who you are. I mean, you can be fucking XXMLG Jesus, okay? And you're gonna get someone in the background being like, Yeah, that Jesus guy, not a big fan, okay? Not a big fan. That Jesus guy, hope he fucking dies. Hope he gets hit by a bus, okay? I hope he falls over and a train runs over his fucking kneecaps, okay? Not a great guy. Not a big fan. No, but everybody gets hate, period, okay? It doesn't matter who you are. And no, I'm not gonna turn this video into one of those videos that are like, Yo, the haters are just jelly of me. The haters are just jelly people, okay? The haters really love you, but they just can't confess their love, so they're jealous. And that's why they hate you. Hey, jelly hater, how's that jelly? You wanna put some bread with that shit, huh? You jelly hater, huh? It's like, okay, he could be jealous if he doesn't like you, but at the same time, he could just not fucking like you, okay? I'm just saying. And while I'm on this topic, what is up with the fucking people that wear the I love my haters hat, okay? I don't love my fucking haters. I fucking hate my haters, okay? I'm not gonna lie. Like, what the fuck is up with this, like, white knight noble shit that's like, yeah, if you hate my videos and hope I get cancer, I still respect your opinion. It's like, no, motherfucker, if you want me to get cancer, I don't fucking like you. Like, fuck you, dude. Jesus. And look, dude, maybe there is one guy in the comments that's like, I don't care what they say about me. I don't care what they do to me. They could fuck my girlfriend right in front of me. I still will love them the same. It's like, no, dude. If someone wants to crucify me, I'm not saying that I hope he steps on a Lego, but I hope he steps on a big, fat Lego. I swear to God, if I get one comment with something like, you got a lot of people following you, Leafy. You got to be a role model. Just know. Dude, straight up, I remember back when the reptilian shit was really blowing up. I got a comment quoting the fucking Spider-Man movie. The fucking Spider-Man movie. He's all like, with great power comes great responsibility, and you're not using that responsibility. When this guy fucking told me this, I literally just sat there like, are you, are you fucking serious with this shit? Bro, is this real? Am, am I punked? Ashton, where are you, bro? Ashton! Are you here? Is this punked? Please? Please tell me this is punked. And, uh, spoiler alert, it, uh, was not punked. It, uh, nope. Just nope. The comment just made me feel that cringe feeling, you know, like that feeling you get after watching a ton of cringe videos on YouTube. And if you guys don't know what cringe videos are on YouTube, they're basically videos of people doing really fucking stupid and really embarrassing things. And so fucking embarrassing and stupid things that you yourself fucking feel embarrassed for this person, okay? That's ultimately what it is, okay? I feel like I'm gonna get a comment that's like, That's not fucking what it is, okay? Fuck you! And to be fair, most of the cringe videos on YouTube aren't even that fucking bad. Like, some of these people upload videos of just an like, awkward fucking interview, and they're just sitting there in the comments like, Oh my god, I was cringing so hard, it was so rough watching this. And don't get me fucking wrong, if the video takes place in a college and there's like some 25-year-old guy defending My Little Pony and shit, okay, that's pretty fucking bad. But if it's just a fucking interview between a celebrity and just a random, like, interview guy, and the interview guy keeps asking questions and the celebrity wants nothing to do with it, you guys are really gonna be like, oh my god, that's so fucking cringeworthy. It's like, I get it, I guess it's a little bit of a weird conversation, but like, still, it's not that bad. But yet, people are like, oh my god, I can't get past 30 seconds, I was shriveling up inside, oh my god. Like, it's, uh... Is it really that bad, dude? Really? Although every now and then, you'll hit that one video that is really fucking bad, okay? A few days ago, I see this one video of this little kid. By little kid, I'm talking like middle school, okay? Middle school kid. He literally is going around the cafeteria yelling, do the Harlem Shake, okay? And I'm not talking about like, oh, do the Harlem Shake! He is yelling at the top of his fucking lungs. Everybody is staring at him. At fucking everybody! And fucking everybody! And dude, once I saw that video, I don't want to be extreme, but I think I died on the inside. I think I died on the inside. And I think I'm going to end it on that note. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Leave a like if you feel like being a great guy. I'll love you long time. And uh, <laughs> thank you guys so much for all your support recently. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, do the Harlem Shake! I am so sorry, dude. I just had to. I just fucking had to. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.